Hello everyone, welcome to Elite with Dashforecast.com YouTube channel. My name is Henry and today is Wednesday, April 24th, 2019. The time is 2.30 a.m. GMT. And for today, we will be updating the chart of Amazon. Uh, this is 30 minutes chart here. And we can see that uh, the stock has been rallying in an impulsive manner. Uh, so the stock market overall has been extending higher doing a melt up and Nasdaq in fact has already made an all time new high uh, for this year now we could see right here in the shorter cycle that we are looking for a um, an impulsive rally to continue so we have this uh, pullback to 1818 ending with 2 and then from there we are uh, rallying in the wave 3 subdivided also as an impulse we got the five ways up uh, one two three four five ending with one and then we have with two now uh, this there is an overlap here but that is okay with because it is within with one and this can be called uh, you know a leading diagonal so we have with one with two and then now we have with three here and this with three has an extension okay which is typical in the Elliott with principle that with three has an extension so it's almost reaching the 161.8% Fibonacci extension. Uh, it can do another leg higher here to finish uh, complete five ways up. And then also ending with three, maybe around uh, 2000, right? Around 2000. And then after that, it can pull back. And we expect the pullback to continue to get supported in 3711 swing uh, for further upside, okay? Now, when it does this with four pullback, uh, it should not overlap with the wave one, right? That's the. Uh, Elite wave theory and the wave 4 should not overlap with the with the wave 1 uh, and also uh, so this invalidation level here really is not really relevant this invalidation level is only for that minor push on the upside to finish a 5 ways up but once it does this wave 4 technically the more important level is this wave 2 right? because I think at this stage this is just uh, it's very quick rally to the upside and then that's it it's complete is i mean the three ways is complete uh, with three is complete and then should be doing a pullback which is not a sell by the way okay we don't like selling again it can always keep extending higher but this with two really is the more important level or uh, this with one actually right it should not overlap with this with one so this with two later on so this with four should uh technically be around 23.6 38.2 retracement of the wave 3 but we need to wait for the wave 3 to finish okay before we can measure the retracement right so typically wave 4 is around 23.6 to 38.2 uh, retracement uh, in a in a guideline okay and then after that we should get another leg higher now looking back at the slightly bigger picture, uh, here we got this uh, 4 hour chart, now of course it's not a complete count, uh, we do have all the counts in different time frames, in all 4 time frames with a regular update in our site. You can always try our service via 14 days free trial uh, and the link is provided in the description of the video. So we have here Amazon 4 hour chart from last year, uh, December 24th, uh, we have what looks like some sort of ABC zigzag at least if not one two three then at least it's an ABC uh, but we have not reached the hundred percent right we have not reached the hundred percent so that suggests that we could continue to see more upside in the shorter cycle until at least it reaches 2033 right so in the shorter cycle here we can continue to find buyers every single dips every single dip dip is not a sell right dips is not a sell it will continue to find support for more upside you can see the right side is higher right it's not really a sell uh, can continue to find support in 3711 swing until at least it reaches 2033 and then depending on the, uh, the uh, and then from here we have a chance to go to pull back a larger degree but this is a big area so you cannot pick the exact level where it's going to end you can always keep extending higher within the blue box but the minimum target is going to be 2033 if this can go to a full 100 percent but anyway whether we go to 2033 or not if we just look at the 
a shorter cycle all we need to know is that this is one two three with an extended three so all we need to know is uh, we're gonna get pullback and that pullback should find buyers for just one more like higher to finish of five waves up from this low okay so hopefully you uh, enjoy the video and uh, see you all again next time